Welcome to part two to the alien attack playthrough. This is Grim here, and of course, welcome back to the Am's Family Mystery Mansion. Now, there are some things that we're going to be talking about here, and I will be trying to be careful because I just kind of came back from recovery from being sick. I still have something left, but I will, you won't know this. Unfortunately, this was recorded back after the fact, so. You shouldn't hear any more problems, but I digress. Anyways, um, I was given the artwork for this piece, so I wanted to share with you what this is. So there you go, that's what it looks like here. It looks nice, but there's also something new in this update that I kind of hinted at. There was this new feature. You're about to see what that is. Because the camper's returned. Yes, the camper is back, baby. <laughs> And uh, this time it's space themed, and it's interesting with what they do there. But we'll talk more about that when we get into the game. But let's take a look at some of the posts that were sent during this time. One of which is this, talking about the new update to the catacombs, which is introducing new ghosts, I guess, because they're now doing um, mining or something of that nature. Uh, it's interesting once we get to there exactly what that's all about. Talking about Morticia's nice costume, because of course they did. We also have a new assimilation um, level, which is basically the hospital area, which is it'll be interesting once we kind of talk about that when we get there. And last but not least, we talk about Wednesday's outfit, because it's on Wednesday, because. I don't know. Again, they, they try to keep it active or something like that, so that's what it is. And um, lately, I've been noticing that these um, post-alternate um, thumbnails for the apps have been kind of a consideration, but this time they seem to put a lot more effort into it. So here's another version of this, which is basically Wednesday. However, they've decided to put her in the actual costume that she's in so it's quite interesting that they actually go ahead and you know, just put her in a different background and whatnot so again I'm gonna try my best to try to catch these as much as possible and kinda of share with you when I do get them but you know it's what it is right so anyways we're gonna dive right back into the game this is taking place back on October the 6th of 2022 well welcome to part 2 and uh, well would you look at that they finally put some Halloween decorations up and about, finally. After I <clears throat> politely reminded them. See? Look. Spooky skeleton coming out. See, a bunch of stuff going on right now. And apparently, um, it was supposed to be something big next week coming up. But, um, oh yeah, and then there's the bombs again. Nice. See, this is what I missed last year. Nice to see them kind of back doing this again. Right. But that's not the only thing going on right now. Because, if you remember last year, we got introduced to the camper. Right? Let me just go back here again. Yes, yeah, this ca the camper right here. Right? This thing. And it was only available for, uh, for the year. Like for three months or so. Like a season. Right? Well... Would you believe it? There's a new quest. And this has the camper stuff with it. It's a new theme. If you can believe it. This is the big thing they're talking about. God knows what this is all about. What's up with those pumpkin spaceships in the sky? Hi, Margo. What are you doing here? Trying to pick up Parker? If it's some kind of room delivery, they should know that I hate pumpkin pie. Well, is this taking place in the simulation? It's worse than that. It's an alien invasion. The mansion's under attack. Uh, I guess it is. Nice to see that they're bringing the simulation people into this. We must do something. Not only are there aliens, but orange is also an awful color scheme. Aw, oh, and now I hate you even more, Marco. Orange is a great color. Ah, uh, okay. I ended up winning that, but I don't know what I did. Travel to the camper. 
Well, I obviously didn't travel to the camper, did I? I traveled to it last year. What, does that count? Fine, let's go over there. Whoa. We're safe here in the camper, but how can we protect the town from the aliens? Okay, that's funny. So everyone that isn't the Adams are now in the camper this time around. Interesting. That's weird. We should take the fight to them. They won't expect a counterattack. Okay, I love this idea what they have going on here. Also, the music does not fit this at all. That would be great if only we have a spaceship, but we don't. I guess we're gonna make our spaceship, won't we? It's a long shot, but what if we retrofit the camper? It just might work. Now I'm curious how this will work. Again, I ended up winning. What did I do? Oh, thanks, I guess. I, d I don't know what just happened. It'll take a lot of work to turn the camper into a space battleship. Fortunately, there's lots of scrap lying around from Wednesday's evil schemes. Great. We can use them to boost the engine and our defenses. And the Sark. Maybe we could turn it into some kind of missile launcher. Nice. That'd be hilarious to see. Alright, here we go. Van conversion, finally. Layout and repair the hanging shark. Oh god, this is going to be a little while, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, well, give me a second. Alright, I'm back. Let's see if this works now. Yeah, there you go. So I can do the hanging shark, but do I have enough for this? I do not. Of course I don't. Alright, well, I guess you guys are just going to have to sit here and wait around, don't you? Oh, you know what? I just realized. Everybody but the maestro is here. So I guess screw him, I guess. <laughs> he, he can just rot for all we know. Everyone else can survive but him? Nah, goodbye, maestro. Nice knowing ya. Alright, that's fun. Let's just go back to the mansion now while we wait, I guess. How long will this take to repair? Oh god, that's so long. Last time it was like a few minutes, but now it's like, uh, I guess it makes sense. Fixing it is e like fast, but turning into something else takes a while. I guess it makes sense. But, uh, yeah. Oh, I can start making other stuff too if I really want to. Oh, so I, I could just start doing this if I really wanted to, but I guess I won't. Just making sure. Oh, I could do that. But I'm not going to right now. I'm just making sure that, uh... You know. Okay, so good. They're not doing ridiculous uh, things like, uh... Oh, give us the books and give us uh, the, um... What do you call it? The, the hammers and whatnot. So that's nice. Alright, I guess I'm going to have to do that slowly but surely with the quest line. So that way I don't glitch it like I did before. Also, I guess I'm going to have to get that new uh, screen shaver thing. And I probably already showed it this part, but, you know, we'll see. Alright, we're back in the mansion. So while they are doing that, I figure let's go ahead and uh, pick up some stuff. So we need to do this again. The quest. We got that, which means we can now do this. There we go. So now we just need to make one cosmic cake and then just collect cosmic lollipops and then we're done with that. Sounds fun. Indeed. Right. So that's it for now. So yeah, interesting. Uh, I guess that's the big thing that's coming up. That's cool. All right. Well, that's that, I guess, for now. Oh, Morticia, guess who got his exterminator outfit first? Guess I'm gonna have to go ahead and get rid of them bugs. Eat them my right head. Yum, yum. Oops. Sorry. Yay, got a little oo-woo plushie, and uh, we didn't get to see much of that, but, uh, you know. It's there. Hi, you. Hi, Broken. Hi, Glitch. How are you? 
I know. Something's wrong with you. I don't know why. We're going to pretend you don't exist right now. There you go. Get to look cool. Stupid, but cool. So let's see that new animation you got going on there, which is... There you go. Fumergate gives us poo-poo. Mmm, compost. Yum, yum. Alright, so there you go doing that. So, I guess... Um... Alright, I guess I have to hide this for now. So that's what you do. You just kind of fumigate, which... Yeah, I mean... I wouldn't have it any other way faster. You're just doing that. Cool. Alright. Yeah, yeah, I see you, you uwu plushie. I don't care. Uwu invader. Let's put you back. They let you squish faster. There you go. Right, that's about it. Just wanted to share that because I opened the box, so... Yay! So we're back here because if I click on... Well, okay, let me just do this. All right, so this one's one minute. So this take it only takes one minute to change the layout for some reason. Why? No idea. It just does. Meanwhile, the f the this good old Sharky boy is gonna turn into a rocket. Oh, ooh boy, yeah, wow. Uh, certainly did do that. Wow. Okay. Well, that's that's somewhat interesting. So I'm kind of curious to see where the story goes with this, but. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm going to have to stall for a little bit. Because we're also going to continue on with the other quest, which is the main one. But I just wanted to see where this leads into once uh, the room is done. How long is it now? Oh, God, I could spend it for one measly diamond, but I'm not going to ruby. I'm going on rubies, but I can't. You would think it'd be free, but nah, okay, whatever, fine. I waited. We're done. Alright, let's see how this looks. I can't stand looking at that sock. It reminds me of when I was used as bait. Uh, excuse me, Maestro, where are you? I can't see you anywhere in this building. So, uh, as far as I know, you don't exist. That's a great idea, Maestro. We can hang you outside as we approach the aliens. Yeah, I thought you liked that the first time, so let's do it again. Then, when they're salivating, BANG! We hit them with a missile from the shock. There you go. And, uh, yeah, wow. Look at this place. Certainly did some lot of work. Alright, what does Dr. Flamby have in store? I want to get my hands on some of these Halloween aliens. By the way, this is the first time we actually hear this guy, so I only hope that I did his justice. I don't know. At this point, I'm just going to assume I did a good job. Why? Do you want to cook one up in a pie? Or soak it with some onions? Of course not. I'm a man of science. Although that does sound delicious. Yeah, we can use your head as the lighter. But more importantly, I want to study them to learn more about them. Okay, what are we working on now? Repair the microscope, repair space couch, and space couch front. Alright. Oh, great, we need dolls. Alright, so... Oh, no, sorry, I don't mean to click on you. This. We need more of that, which we don't got. And we need one more flower, which... Give me a sec. Sorry, as I was saying, all right, mm, now eight hours to just convert the chair. All right, well, this should be interesting. Also, interesting that they decided to help the atoms out, but I guess it's just more for their own safety rather than, you know, I'm just surprised. But I guess because Margo's part of the family now, you know, she has obligation to. Oh, that and also faster. I forgot about that. So, yeah, I got that going on. Sorry, I don't mean to click on you. All right, so it's not the small desk. So where is this microscope? Oh, it is the small desk. Yeah, so I have Wednesday doing this right now. So, um, you know, I will do that. So I guess for now, that's it for in here. So these guys are just going to be chilling out for a bit until I get the supplies need. But let's go back to the mansion and finish that quest off, shall we? Oh, boy. Yeah, yeah. Mm. 
Welcome back. Sorry. That was a nice travel. All right. Well, now we're done this. And um, I'm kind of asleep before it. But, uh, you know, it's whatever. It's whatever. So we got that. Click on this. Yeah, just to make sure. So now let's just do this. And, uh, yeah, poor, poor sucker. He died. Died helping the fan. There's some random who decided to come into the house. Let's unleash Tango de la Mort, Gomez. The aliens will feel our passion. Oh my god, I know what they're doing now. They're going through everything that happened thus far. Okay, now I'm getting why it's called... <laughs> oh, okay. So how's November, December gonna end, huh? I'm curious. Mom is spinning and throwing poison daggers. Wow. So impressed that he was sleepy about it. Look at this. Look how happy he is. Oh man, that's bored. I'm going to throw the dagger at Parkman first to squash these pumpkin heads. You know, I should have probably rechanged them for their costumes, but eh, can't be bothered. That's right, Pop. Hit him with the deadly puns as well as poison blades. It's working. At least I know where he's getting his puns from. <laughs> Hey, we did it. So now comes the, uh... Getting not the... What the... Not the aliens, but you know what I'm talking about. Now it's, now it's the invaders, but... Now we're gonna be like, Ah, time to use my bazooka. <laughs> time to use my jet. They're not my jet, but you know... You know, you know what I'm talking about, my little jeep. Yeah, that. Wait, where is it? Give me a sec. I know I can find it. Ah, oh, there it is. Yeah, this thing. <laughs> you watch. That's exactly what's gonna happen. I don't like this scene, Fester. Paint us a different outcome. I called it. I called it. I told you. I made a new post-apocalyptic battle jeep full of paint. <laughs> I can't wait to unleash it. Yeah, take my monster blood ooze. I learned it from the other game. Mash the gas pedal and take him out, Uncle Fester. Makes me wonder what that Pumpkin Lord guy is thinking of with seeing all this. He's like, what, what, what is going on? Why did I invite this place? It's time to die, you dastardly aliens! I'm coming for you! Oh, oh, I see how you got, you got away with saying that, huh, Fester, huh? You think the YouTube algorithm's gonna figure that out? Well, no, let's find out. Now that he's crashed into the alien robot, he'll never get rid of that green paint. Paint it green. Oh, nice. We need the trip mines and we need... <sighs> More flags. I see. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna do this instead. Oh, wow, look. I, I got the bombs already. Hooray. So now it's just to get this. Gonna take my time, because I'm not interested in getting it just yet. Although, I'm hoping that I didn't screw myself over once it comes in. But, I guess we'll find out, won't we? Nice. So we're getting some stuff here. And, eh. Alright, well, I mean, it's better than nothing. I want to get this first, and then I can focus my attention on the Adams Family flag. How about that? Alright, satellite first, then flag. Because I also need stuff for, uh, the, this, the case, you know, the, the caravan. I wonder if we're gonna get that near the end. Probably. I don't know where to put it, though. Unless it's a costume. I don't know, I guess we'll find out. We're back here slowly because we want to get this from Wednesday for a thing. Open a box for no reason. Get this. I was about to say get disappointed, but then I got, oh yeah, cookie box. I remember that. I, for, I totally not forgot. We unlocked pumpkin spawners as well as this later on, so that's cool. Very cool. But as you can see, I finally got this cupcake here, and I'm almost going to get done this. And when I'm done with that, I will focus my attention on the Adam's flag. But, as you notice, I did pick on Wednesday for a certain reason. And that reason is because of this. Yes, this place again. 
as you can tell, I finished this one chair, so that's cool. As you can tell, uh, we got some things here we guess we're going to have to do at some point too, but uh, I'll wait when it asks me to. How about that? But, uh, what was this? Yeah, this. So let's do that right now. And the last thing we need to do is repair this, which we need this, which we can't do because I need it for the curtain stuff. So again, slowly but surely, but you know, they're making these guys the resistance of making the do. And uh, so far it's turning out so good. Uh, weird. I wonder if we actually are going to get another, uh, you know, the retrofit for the camper or we get a new camper. I guess we'll find out, but. Yeah, nice to see that these guys are at least doing something here. So, good for them. Collecting some of these. Which will make it this. Oh boy, oh boy. Got me my satellite. There we go. Look at this thing. I don't even know where I'm going to put this. I guess maybe in the back. Yeah, why not? There you go. Alright, so now I have to do this. And then I also have to collect the uh, the other thing. Which um, I guess I'm going to have to do, don't I? Yeah, alright. So I guess there's that as well. And now I just have to wait for that. Do it one more time. And I should be able to get finish the other area as well. At least, I hope. Ah, looks like we're done finally the paint a green thing. So let's finish this and see what happens next. I'll turn a page in the enchanted book to some kitty's alter ego. Yeah, I was curious on how you're going to do that, but I guess this makes sense. You've seen a grin without a lion. But how about a pumpkin without a head? <laughs> anyone who says that a little wonder in their life never hurts anyone has never seen this. Well, a chest lion eating a pumpkin or alien with a big grin on his face is a rare sight. Also very creepy to say the least. <laughs> I want to paint it green. Not black, green. Nice. Alright, let's see how this goes now. Also, oh, well, kind of looks fixed there. Maybe it was just the in-game thing that's glitched. I don't know, whatever. Let's open the box. Open the box! Nothing important. Oh boy. Mother. Perhaps you'll share some gardening tips with these pumpkins. Cleopatra and Ichabog, prepare to defend the mansion with leaves and branches. I have to make tree noises. I don't know what that would be. I can't believe I just witnessed a tree using a wrought iron fence to Julian a pumpkin. My god, Ichabok is just violent, isn't he? <laughs> He's just like, uh, don't piss him off. That, that's, my, that's the thing I've learned today. What do you expect, Father? It's an Adam's Halloween, after all. An Adam's Sci-Fi Halloween Wednesday. Pumpkin Invader obtains Sweetness Scanner. So what's a Sweetness Scanner? Oh, I need those lights for something else. All right, I'll get the people to do the things again, because, you know, I need them light bulbs for the other thing that's currently going on right now. You might know what I'm talking about. It's the, uh, the, uh, <sighs> God, I can't think of the name now. The camper. There we go. Uh, why did I blank out for that word? I, God. <sighs> There you go. Alright, so that's that's going on there. Now that's fun. Oh, if only I had you, I could get the sweetness scanner, but I don't. And once I get everything I want... Oh, 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 oh boy. 
Oh, oh boy. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, the fester's broken. <laughs> oh, God. I'm oh, sorry, Ichabod. You don't do anything for me. No offense. All right. There we go. So, there's that. Righty o. Mm. <sighs> what should we do now? Hmm. You know what? Let's go to the other place just to show you what I got going on. All right, so we're in the cave expansion, and as you can see, the table's done. Ooh, look at that, man. But yeah, as you can see, I'm trying to get this here, but you may have noticed I'm also getting a lot of this stuff here kind of like ready to go. And this is partially the reason why, by the way, because of this stuff here. Because I want to get make it so that I have everything ready to go. In fact, currently the family is getting this right now. Um, you know, the four. Then, oh god, sorry. Petunia, I don't mean to do that. Yeah, so you see, like, I got most of this ready to go. So once it's like, oh, we need to do the prize antlers in the fridge. And it's like, oh, well, check, check. I can do that right now. But, uh, you know, it's going to take me a little while. But uh, don't worry. I'll get there. I kind of don't want to do it without, you know, it glitching the storyline. So, yeah, I'm being a good boy. So, hopefully soon I'll be able to come back here and uh, start things off. So, that'll probably be the next clip, to be honest. Maybe. And we're back a bit. But I wanted to go ahead and talk about if I can find her. I don't know where she disappeared to. She was here a moment ago. God, I don't know where she went. <laughs> oh, all right, whatever. I guess I'll do this a long way. Where did you go? Where did you go Wednesday? Show me. Yes, take me to where you were. <laughs> oh, whatever. I'll do it here then. <laughs> so I ended up seeing the full trailer to Wednesday and seeing um, it being released in the end of November, roughly. I think during the week of uh, Thanksgiving, I think. And I gotta say, I'm real interested with how they're kind of portraying this. It looks to be pretty good. And I believe Wednesday's um, Rumi in the show, I believe is the same actress who actually played the original Wednesday back in the 90s. I might be mistaken, but I believe that's who it is. But what I find interesting is just how they got everything going. I might be wrong. I mean, I don't know. But, but yeah, I'm, I'm real interested to see how this turns out. And it looks pretty good. I'm hoping I'm not disappointed when I do see it. But, you know, I guess we'll uh, let that kind of come across when it does. But anywho, we're here for a few reasons. One of them is to get through the assimilation. That being one. Well, not really assimilation, but, you know, the camper. Because they assimilated people from assimilation doing the stuff. But I feel like this is also going to be the time to do stuff. Yeah, and also I have to do that as well. See if I can continue on from there. But I guess we'll go to that when we get to there. So let's go to the camper now. All right, so we're in the camper. So let's go ahead and uh, finish this off. <clears throat> and as you can see, I got some stuff kind of going on here as we speak. Yeah, so I should be fine, I think. I'll try my best to kind of keep at this. But uh, yeah, needless to say, we're kind of going on from here. Let's go back to the mansion real quick. And we're back. All right, so now let's go ahead and do this. So, there you go. Now, I guess while we wait, I should probably also get some more of these light bulbs. Seeing how I'm going to need them walking forward. By the way, can I find it where Wednesday is? God, I don't know where she went to. That girl just disappeared off of me. It's not fun, Wednesday. Fine, you know what? Let me find out where you are by doing this. I have to wait for the loading times, unfortunately. Yeah, it would have been interesting to see a crossover, but, eh, I guess not. But, um, anyways, do light bulb. 
Oh, so you're all the way down there. What are you doing down there? Anyways, let's just get characters to do light bulbs for me. So that way it helps me later on with the um, thing. Oh yeah, that's right. You don't do anything for me, Ikebog. But yeah, anyways, looking forward to seeing how this turns up with Wednesday's new show. With the Tim Burton one. So, yeah, I guess uh, we'll see what ends up happening in so Return when things are done. Yay! <laughs> what do we have here? Looks like the chair is done. I've grown some of the alien plants you found, Dr. Flamby. They're fascinating. I can even hear them whispering in my mind now. That, uh, that, that, that's kind of disturbing. Perhaps I should integrate those plants if they're communicating with you. I have plenty of torture tools. Hmm, I'm sure they'd work on flora as well as fauna. Yeah, just say that you're going to bring you closer to your head. I'm sure they'll talk when they're on fire, on, uh, what do you call it? On fire? <laughs> I know, there was a saying for, like, on the spot or something like that. I don't know. But anyways, this should help us continue. No! Sorry, but I didn't mean to click you. This talk of food it reminds me that we'll need supplies for a space journey. Ah, repair the fridge. Gotcha. We could be stranded for months. Of course, we could eat the maestro, but... Uh... Man, I feel bad for that guy. He just keeps on just getting a uh, mount on, you know. He just doesn't exist, so I guess they must have ate him already. Also, Ringo, a moment ago, just walked behind the fireplace. How? Don't worry, Maestro. That's just a backup plan. First, we'll try a refrigerator. Alright. Space fridge, space bar, space piece, supply, cup of board. So do that, do that, and do that. Good. All right, so we got that going on here, so we should be done for this for now, but that's not all. Yes, we're back here because, if you can tell, I'm done this, which means we can continue with the quest. Yay. Now we just need to put down the little ooboos. We got one. We got one ubu. So there you go. Look. I'm sorry, where did you go? Oh, you're way over there. Don't run away from me. Look at that face. <laughs> How can you take that threatening? Cleopatra, what are you calling out to? Oh, I see. What is it, her uncle, Big Baba? <laughs> Yeah, it's it's the thing I figured. There's nothing like a little green power to take down alien invaders. Hey, plant power. We did it. And nice, but we got the next one ready to go. So let's see what we need to craft now. Let's see if grandma has any good pumpkin recipes up her sleeve. All right, it's the freaky food fight now. Also, man, that's just so, um, the music is so loud, I've noticed. Not that it's a bad thing, but it's just like, ooh, compared to the normal one, it just seems overpowering. And uh, I bet you Pugsy's demolition outfit's gonna be in handy next one, isn't it? There's nothing better for cooking aliens than a spaghetti monster. Yeah, the same spaghetti monster and not get to show itself in the original. Play, um, it's using its tendrils to pull them apart. I say that pasta creation is well done. By the way, did we really eat that thing, or is it just... I'm, I'm just gonna stop now. Does anyone else suddenly have an appetite for pumpkin pasta? Eh, yeah, God, no. That sounds good. Pasta al, al dente? Okay, I think I butchered that. Fear ones. Oh boy. Place pumpkin spawner. Alright. 
Well, fortunately, I've been doing that as of now, so... And I will put the pumpkin spawner down in a minute. Uh, oh, sorry, did I just stop doing it? Yeah, I think I did. Sorry, thing. You need to keep on dancing for me. You'll never stop dancing until we unlock your costume. Sorry, buddy. It's just life. Right. Mm. So we're going to make three of these, which should be okay. Not too difficult. And then we need to do pumpkin spawner. And then by the time we come back, the other area should be done. So that should be fun. Well, it's Tuesday and a new request has hit. We've been in this thing for one week. And do you want to know what it is? <laughs> it's the pumpkin invader. Yeah, so you can get a pumpkin, another pumpkin invader for free. All you need is cause five, six cosmic lollipops. Three of the spooky bombs, three of the astronaut helmets, and two of the alien spaceships. Now, the thing is, with the uh, spooky bombs, I got that going just fine. Alien spaceship is going to be difficult because I need to do this, and I'm going to be waiting until that's requested for me to get. And then there's the astronaut helmet, which just needs this, so, you know, there's that. Now, hold on. You might also be thinking, hey, why don't we just do the... Um, uh, what do you call it? Um, the assimilation thing. I mean, you know, the assimilation crew and the uh, the thingy. And the thing is, only two two of the things are done, not all three. So I will return once they are all done, and we can continue off from there. And that will also be the time when we get this done. So, yeah. Be on the lookout for that. Right. So, before we click on their other stuff, let's just go ahead and do this here. Because I want to make sure, before we move on, that we don't need to craft anything so we can kill two birds with one stone, right? So, let's just place this spawner here. Nice. I guess I'm going to organize this later on, once I get stuff going. Where are those explosions coming from? Are the aliens launching a new attack? Huxley and Lertz have been busy planting explosives around the alien ships. It's raining pumpkin goo. It's disgusting, but I like it. Yeah, I knew they were going to bring that back now. I guess it's going to be monster, uh, monster fester now. Mm, alien pumpkin parade. That does sound good. All right. Man, I feel so bad for the pumpkin aliens because they're just getting annihilated now. Let me put down more of the pumpkin things. There we go. More of them. Open up a box. There you go. Alright, so let's see the next quest. Auntie Sloom, these aliens were mermaid to order for your cousins. Ah. <sighs> Why puns? Come, let's just summon a crack in my sisters of the sea. Why don't you just turn Fester into a monster again? I think that worked the last time. We're ahead of you, cousin. Let's send it to capture more of the alien ships. Now we've got them on the run. The Kraken is smashing in the ships. Although, how did they get this, uh, the Mer sister family out? I mean, they're in water, aren't they, in the swamp? Let's get cracking. Place shadow lights and the candy collector. Ah, uh, see, good, I didn't do that because I need this anyways. For stuff for this. You know, the alien spaceship. So let's just do that. Alright. So, means I can at least start with this here. Slowly make my way on stuff. Again, we're doing our best, but this also means that we can continue on with our other area over there, so let's go ahead and take a look into there, shall we? Ah, camper. There we go. Let's unlock this stuff. So the cabin's done. It's now an aquarium for some reason. The table's down. It's now the, I'm assuming, blueprint of the ship or something like that. So now let's do the fridge. Would you guys really eat me to save yourselves? Don't worry, Maestro. We've never lied to you. That, uh, 
doesn't really answer my question. No time for questions. We have lots to do. Don't ask questions you're not ready to know the answers to. There are space snacks, and we got the fridge now. I love the fact that despite them changing it to something weird, that they still have, like, the postcards still on it. You know, to still keep it true to what it was. We'll need to fashion the command center for the captain of the SIP. Speaking of which, who's going to be the captain? I'll volunteer for the position. It's my duty to lead this mission. You, Margo, the leader of the weirdos? I doubt it. Wow, that was fast. I thought we'd have to draw straws to get a captain. Commander Margo. Alright, get the command table, data panel, captain's chair. So, there we go, got that going on. Got the data panel. Got that going on. That's, yeah, okay. We got nine hours. How long is this? Seven hours. How about this? Captain's chair. No, not the fireplace. What's the captain's chair? God, nine, nine hours for all this stuff to get done. Dear, dear, oh dear. At least we're almost done, I think, because we have one, two, three. Yeah, so we, this is probably going to be the last one where we get to do the lamp, the uh, other things as well. I'm assuming, because that seems to be the only things left to do here. Yeah, so the pie's antlers. Got the fireplace, we can do that, and then we got this here. So, you know, I guess I, guess I could start it, but nah, I'm not going to. I'm just going to let it just go with the flow, man. Speaking of, I guess that will be it for now. So, uh, I guess I'll see you whenever. Well, the things are done. So, table's now done, so it now looks like that. This is done, so it looks like this. And now let's finish Margot's chair. Wait, why do you guys let me be captain so quickly? Yeah, something's up. It's because you'll make a great captain, Margot. You're lying. Definitely not, because the cap goes down with the ship as the crew escapes. Ah, uh, see, there we go. Also, Margo walked behind the, uh, the fireplace again. Why is that? That's weird. But now it makes sense. Yeah, there you go. All done. The chair doesn't look different, does it? It looks pretty much the same. Alright, so I guess time to do the final things, which is... Yeah, the final things, and then we're done. So, how are we going to power this tub anyway? You need something capable of providing acceleration in an airless void. Could Wednesday spare black hole be useful? There's one in the pile of scrap! Okay, first of all, where does she get a black hole from anyways? And why should she have one lying around? Also, what kind of voice is that woman? We can use it to generate an anti-meth reaction. I'll whip up something in a jiffy. Man, if only there was a creature like Nibbler, we could have used its poop to, you know, fuel the ship. Oh well, got better than nothing. There we go. Black hole battery, lava lamp, alien, tropiary. So yeah, got that done. That's done. And last but not least. Ew. Right. I had to do it for... The helmet things. So, um, yeah, that's gonna be a little while. Whoops. Don't worry. Uh, I'll come back once the stuff is done. So, uh, we're soon gonna take off, guys. Don't you worry. Right, we're back after a few hours. I ended up getting this, so that's good. So now I just need the alien spaceship. But there's another reason why I'm doing this, and that's because of this. If you remember, we had this in the past, and I was waiting for money, but because we were archiving a lot of stuff as of late, I figured, hey, why not start this? Should be enough for us to get this going, hey? So, I'm just going to try to figure out where I can put this junk somewhere off to the side without it really causing problems, but... Oh dear, I'm going to have to find ways to hide this or put this somewhere so there's one and now we need to do one more and then we're done 
Here we go. There has to be a way we can efficiently ship its clothing. Parker, I'll work on the product side while you set up the business end. Great. I'll get our Adam Co. online store and social accounts up and running. There you go. All done. Now let's continue on with this and see where we go from there. No, stop it. How's your designs working going, Cousin It? Adam's Co. needs some product. Hey, look at that. It's girl boss Parker. <laughs> Looking like a CEO from a tech company, doesn't she? Yeah, kids are meat power. Yes, I understand that we can't rush an artist. Just do your best. Start to act like a business too. It gotta be faster. Have him do the animation thing and get fashion sketches, so Alright, so he's gotta be doing this for six, twelve, eighteen hours. Just to do this stuff. Well, I mean, at least we don't have to buy anything, so that's good. We can continue on a little bit faster, so there's that. But yeah, so we're making progression. We're going to get to... Oh, nice jump. So we're going to get to the catacombs soon enough, but like I said, the catacombs, when it first comes out, is going to be something else entirely. But, you know, no. Oh. By the way, we got this down here. So you know what that means? It's time to do this. No. Where is it? There we go. Now we got this stuff working. So these are going to be done real quick. As you can see. However this. 12 hours. So that means when I come back after work. This should be done. And I think from there. I believe after that. Um, that's it. And then we get a special prize. That's my thoughts anyways. So, I'll see you in a bit. Welcome back. As you can see, I have one more left to do, and I'm kind of doing it right now. But that's not the only reason why I'm doing this. Uh, the main reason is because I got the candy collectors. Which means, I now just have to place the satellite down. And we will be complete with this mission. We've repelled the initial alien attack. Now it's time to take the fight to them. The aliens have fled in their remaining ships. How can we go after them? What a bunch of babies. Obviously, we'll need to create our own spaceship. Well, it just so happens that uh, someone's already doing that right now. I mean, it's not exactly rocket science to figure that out, Pop. Hehehe, <laughs> funny. <laughs> There we go. I guess with no, no nightmare demons. I'm surprised. Wow. I thought it would be nightmare demons, but no. And, uh, by the way. Cool beans. Ah, oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Yes, this is what I want. Uh, eh, 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 eh. <sighs> Add. I'm sorry. I thought I had another box, but it's like, nope. Add. Then box. At least we got this. So that's something, I guess. Alright, see where we go from here. We have all sorts of scrap material in the mansion. Let's use it to make a rocket. If you give me one second, Wednesday, I can make you one. I'll use parts from my battle jeep, as I also keep spare rocket thrusters handy. Fester, you're still glitched. I'll start welding now. There's no time to lose. Yep, we have to get to that candy back from the aliens. We can't let them steal Halloween. Into space we go. Blast off. Prepare the spooky torpedoes. Uh, why is Wednesday talking? It's supposed to be Gomez. That, uh, uh, awkward. Alright. Get the space candy, battle core, astronaut helmet. Huh, right. So, I'm kind of doing that right now, aren't I? Darn. I guess I need to make more, don't I? Alright, whatever. But yeah, anyways, let's go to the other place to put, get our rocket ship. Ah, got me some diamonds too. Cool. Alright, now let's finish this and get us our new mansion thingy. Also, I think uh, this, this is a bit glitched here, but okay. 
Got a lava lamp. Got the black hole thing. And finally, last but not least, alien monument. All systems are ready. Let's blast off. The scanners detect the Adams rocket heading towards the mothership. Huh, I guess they beat him to the punch. And uh, I guess I wasn't there yet. Uh, oops, I, I <laughs> went ahead at schedule. Fire up the engines. Let's go save the Adams family. That is so weird to say Mar hear Margot say that. Especially with the original movie, how she was. There you go, we got everything there. And look, oh my god, what is that? Is that what I think it is? Oh, I think it is. So now these guys can just stay here forever. Until the thing goes away. So they can enjoy, you know, this. But yeah, let's put our rocket ship down. Oh boy. And look, I've made some room for the old from the old one. There it is. Oh man, it drops gems as well. That makes me so happy. Oh my god, this is huge. Really? I didn't think it would be that big. Really? Okay, I guess. There. <laughs> now let's try. As I was saying. There. I guess there. Wow, look at that. Look at that improvement. Old model. New model. They did a good job. Like what they did to the the spacecraft. Now now it's even worse. It's a hybrid. <laughs> Oof, God. Alright, well, there we go. Got that done. One down. Now we need to do the us. And you know what? We haven't even gotten to the deals yet, so... God, that's gonna be another thing. Taking a long time to see the animations and whatnot, so... Oh boy. Got me out in space. Collect it in gold. And now, meet that pumpkin invader. More oopoos. Oh no, Gomez, watch out. Here comes another invader. <laughs> Ooh woo, give me candy. Yeah, I still have to kind of decorate this properly, but you know. There we go. Look at them. You can't. How can you take these things threatening wise? Like. You know, it's very Halloween-y, Alien Invaders, but still, it's like, look at them. How can you take that seriously? Like, watch. <coughs> See? They squeak. <coughs> they squeak every time I hit them. <coughs> you can't take that seriously. I'm just saying. It's just like the other thing. But, although this is just editing. They, they don't really squeak at all. Like, see? They, just, they don't. I just do that just for fun, because... I'm a video entertainer at the same point, but yeah, anyways, uh, two down, two more to go, and, uh, no bundles or anything, I did it all by myself, so I am proud. But tomorrow should be Friday, which means deals, which means we're gonna find out which of the packs are going on sale, which means that I'm gonna go get some, so we're gonna see some characters go through stuff, and I have no idea if this is probably the end of part two going into part three because of how long the other one's gonna be. But, you know, we'll wait and see what ends up happening. And, uh, who knows? Maybe part two will be very long. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Also, yeah, I'm still gonna be doing this because, you know, astronaut helmets. Oof. Well, as I suspected with the weekend, we got our sales. The pack, uh, feature thing didn't pop up. But by the looks of things, it looks like the gold pass and the alien invader pack is on sale. So, why don't we do one before the other? So let's go with the gold pass rule first, shall we? And we're done. Just like that. Good. Now, time comes to this. Oh, we only get the one. Anyways, we got a Space Warrior outfit for Parker. We got one for Lurch. And we also got one for Cousin It. There we go. Also, he has glasses over glasses, so that's weird. Alright. Alright, cool. We're gonna get you, Socrates, in a minute. But let's unlock and do the thing. So first, 
Let's just do Cousin Up because he's the closest. Well, okay, Lurch as well, but you know. So we got that. So now you can do Panic. However, I also need you to do this for me. Because you need one more. You need to do one more, and then you're all good. So we will look at that a little bit later. Not so much now, but don't worry. It's going to get there. Let's unlock you. And you need to do, you can do Moonwalk. Give us the Atom Rocket, which I think is going to be the next thing we're going to need to craft. So, where are you right now, though? Let me just see. Because I don't want you to be blocking. Man, you're a big guy, but yet I can't find where you are. I hopefully I can find you. But let's see. Unless I passed you already, which is most likely after editing this, it'll probably be there. Hmm. There you are. Alright, big guy. Maybe you can walk a little bit further out. Because I want to see you moonwalking without a lot of stuff in the way. Maybe? Lurch? There you go. Also, I noticed as soon as he... Like, when he's walking, he has his gloves on. But as soon as he stops, it's like the gloves are gone. So... Some of the animations I find is a little bit weird or wonky. But, uh, you know, this game's been going on for like three, four years now. So, wonkiness is to be expected. <laughs> but hey, could be worse, right? Okay, there we go. There we go. Now let's see this. So this is what he does. It's kind of like dancing, almost like walking in place but yeah this is very spacey and as you can tell the boys are uh looking at him very amused i would say okay cool so now let's do parker 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 my girl come on yes there we go so this is what's this so let's see this so basic. Oh, oh my god. So the rock that killed the person not only apparently also has what? What is this? Is this the squeezers? They're not supposed to be in this update. It's supposed to be pumpkin. Like, you know, I know it's spooky and it's, you know, it's supposed to be pumpkin invaders, not squid monsters. So what is this? Well, either way, this is somewhat interesting that uh, also it's funny how she's standing on top of the ledge thing there it's supposed to be a wall but shh, don't 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 you know question it all right so that's done so let's just do this here and we can get another one but i'm gonna hold off just yet because of this and because i have 28 we're gonna unlock a box so that's great so let's do that so there's this here no Okay, first are good one. Anything good? Uh, no. Alright. Another one. Oh, we're getting Space Warrior costume, which is, you know, it's okay. Oh, nice. Alright, cool. So, um, yeah. So far, this update's not that bad. I really did, I really did, I mean, I'm gonna have to hold off this stuff until, like, the very end of whatever part it will be. I don't even know if this is part three. Or this is going to be the end of part one. Probably the former than the latter, but I don't know at this point. I mean, I might be I might be shocked to find out that this is the last part to part two. But, uh, you know, I guess we'll find out together later on. But, um, yeah. So, this should be interesting as far as trying to level stuff up goes. And uh, something I will state, apparently I've seen people complain about as of recently, is apparently a lot of people are not happy with the idea. Here we go. Um, okay. Uh, to, congratulations for what? That was weird. Okay. Uh, that that was something. That, that was cool. Alright. 
Not that. That was. That was. Ooh, look at that. We unlocked a new costume. Who is this? Let's find out. Hey, Space Warrior Pugsley with his uh, thing cracked. So his head's going to blow up. Or freeze. I don't know which one. It's either freeze or it's going to like expand and blow up. Radio. So you can't do anything because I need a UFO thing. And where is that exactly? Is it on the price? It is on the price track. Okay, cool. So, I don't, you know, it's, at least it's not something where you can... Man, you're getting a lot of these. Okay. So, they're giving you random items in these boxes that have nothing to do with helping you with the with the bundles. I'm not sure why exactly that is. Like, you know, the alien cookie box. You know, I got that type of stuff. Or oh, you're 100% getting... Okay, that's, that's a weird percentage. So, 1%, 10%, 9%, 30%, 100%. percent So what? This is like almost... 150 percent that that's that's weird math man but I, I get what you're trying to say so <clears throat> those are there does that the problem with the boxes that they give you random stuff that doesn't really help you with the event but there's also something else uh in this uh update that i haven't gotten a hand to because again i haven't gotten there yet but the new missions for oh cool the new missions for um, assimilation, oh, not assimilation, no, assimilation's fine, I, as far as I know. But the new missions for the uh, the thing, um, yes, the thing, the catacombs. There you go. So for the catacombs, it has been um, what do you call it? A bit of a, a wonkiness going on with there because of how uh, things have been going on um, with pricing. So some of the items you need for that is ridiculous. Like to give you an example, one of the items is like two hundred and fifty thousand dollar coins, which is like that's a hard like to try to get that is kind of hard to get. I'm not going to put you little guy down because I know you're coming free down the line. And I'm sure the, the quest is going to be like, oh, put it down to get some stuff. Instead, let's put oo-woos. So how much how much of these do I got? Let's see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Hmm. I can probably sell some. 10. Let's just... For now, let's just have it for eight. Yeah, that's good enough. I'll probably get more, to tell you the truth. But, you know, that's the thing. That's why there's no point buying yourself more of the uh, the generators. Because apparently you'll get more of these anyways. Ah, uh, great. You know what that means. Yay. Thank you. Good. Yeah, I figured. It wasn't going to glitch on me again. So that sucks. I remember back in the past, it was so great to hear the da 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 Oh good, more boxes. And more lollipops. This, the boxes never ends. It'll never end. And the reason I'm doing that, you might be wondering, why do I not uh, record, like, like, why do I stop recording this? And like, it's from the boat opening the boxes, right? Well, I did that last before, and uh, I ended up regretting it, because apparently um, I shouldn't do that. Because I will open a box and be like, wow, look at that, look what I've unlocked off camera. Great. So, that's why. So let's just do this some more. Unlocking the boxes. Getting some cost. Getting some costumes. Oh, nice. We got the car the carpet. And, yeah, that also officially ended the uh, thing. So that's great. So we got this down. Looks kind of cool. I like the pumpkins. And the, it made it look like grass. So I, I, do, I do like how they've kind of got that going on here. And uh, goodbye. Go down here. Yep. So what other items do I have right now? I got power cell, 
Oh yeah, I got some more uwus, do I? The uwu invasion. That's what I'm just calling them. I know they're pumpkin invaders, but I'm just calling them uwus because that's what they are. Look at them. Look at these little guys. Um. Anyways, got one more box. Oh, God, sorry, one more box. There we go. And now we're done. Right, so now that we got that out of the way, and I know that there's supposed to be a watching ad, but I'll do that off my off time. So now let's get the Alien Vader pack and uh, see where we go from here. And hopefully this won't be too long. All right, here we go. Finally done. So we got this and we got some more uwus. Yep, look at all the stuff. All right. Nice, keep on getting more levels. Spooky alien costume for Socrates. Alien princess costume for Ophelia. And the neon alien costume for um, Aunt Sloom. Nothing for Grandma just yet. Anyways, more uwus. More, more uwus. What, I can't put anything there. Oh, because of that. Yeah, now I, now I realize. Yeah, so... Look at look at the little little guys. They're invading. So I have a lot more there. I got a I can't put the pump pin cell down. I'll put this down. You get one by the way. I don't know where this one came from. It might be from the box, but I can't tell. So we got a pumpkin dragon for some reason. So Yeah, we'll put them here. Nice. Um we do need this. So we'll put this here for now. Uh, we need to do the alien specimen, I think, somewhere. Probably there. Uh, the this, probably over here. And, um,. Oh, yeah, and no, we got a pumpkin bot, so... Should probably put this guy... So, interesting how the animation changes its face. Like, it, like for me, it's like this creepy face, and then it goes... Duh! You know, kind of face. But, um... You know, uh... Why not? Okay. So, let's just go to the... Costume. So, Socrates is all done. So, that's great. So let's do that, and he's going to be bypass security. So why don't you do that, buddy? Yep, there you go. So he's going to, like, he's going to touch it. Bzzz, shocks him. I don't know what that's supposed to be anyway. I thought that was a sign, but no. He's just, he's just, I don't know what's wrong with him. He's just very upset, like, obsessed with touching it. He's just like, oh, zaps, forgets. He's like, oh, I wonder what this does. Zap, you know. He just loves that. Also, if I'm not mistaken... No, you gave me that. Who gives me the... Oh, you do. Okay, cool. So I don't have to craft another one. See? See? Me smart. That's why I don't bother with stuff like that. Mmm. Big brain. <laughs> not tiny brain. Alright. So, now we got Ophelia. No. That's Loom. Ophelia's coming up. Alright. The Horror. Uh, right, I remember what that is, but I want to see... Oh, you know, Ophelia is right here, so let's just do the Fascinating, so... Alright, so let's just see Fascinating. Okay, that was weird. Um, and then... Yeah, so there she is doing this. A little guy comes in. Zap. <laughs> I love that. You know, she's like, ooh, this is so cool. Zap. <laughs> like, she just knows somebody's behind them, and she just still does it anyways. But still, look how small that little thing is compared to the big ubus. But yeah, I love that. Look at this. I still love that. <laughs> and then we're going to get three of them coming after uh, Aunt Sloom. Which, speaking of, she's in her costume. I just have to find out where she is exactly. I still love the fact that they decided to change the match into Halloween themed. It makes me happy because it's like, you know, we're not going to get this in November. They're going di to disappear with it. Well, the winter one, we get that for, like, all year round. Like, for, for the winter, at least. So, you know, unless they keep it for November. But, you know, I doubtful. All right, let's see this one here. The horror. 
All right. So, yeah. So, she's just standing there. The little guys are coming after her, kind of sneaking up. And he's like, ah! <laughs> yeah. So, she's just... So, the horror of what? The little pumpkin guys are basically, like, sk spooked, I guess. Because look at them. They're, like, kind of, like, going invading. Like, you know, making a little way. Turns around and she's like, oh! And scares off. Still love that. They end up animate these little guys. Again, they try to make them threatening, but they're not. They're like children's plushies. How could he be scared of that? Look at them. You can't be scared of that. Even if they try to go after trick or treat, like, you know, houses for trick or treats, they, they probably wouldn't even know. They would think that, oh, how adorable. Here you go. You know, these, these foolish earthlings are giving us candy for free. That's more like it. Unlike the Adams. Nah, the Adams, that was your biggest mistake. You should have gone house to house. They would have given you it for free. But no, nah, you know, you being dumb. The aliens are dumb. But this is what I'm just realizing now, right? All right, so there we go. And I think that'll be it for now because there's nothing else to... Man, 39, okay, cool. Yeah, so there's nothing really else to kind of go along here that needs to be kind of done. And it's 17, so you know what? Uh, judging by the time of this, I think this might be in part two, and this is probably the finale of it. So chances are we're going to go into part three. We're going to find out what happens in the alien space. Sorry, I clicked an ad. I decided to skip, and now it's broken, as you can see. The sound's gone. It's, it's emptiness, like space. Speaking of, space is coming up next, so... We're going to find out what happens and uh, I guess see if the camper comes across, if, if they're actually going to come into contact with, you know, this thing, the space camper, which apparently it sounds like they are. So, yeah, I guess see you in part three. I'll see if I can fix out what happened with the box, by the way. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is it for this part two. I do want to make an apology that there wasn't much as far as special effects and sound effects went as I did with part one, namely because of how lengthy this is and because, you know, I'm coming back from being sick and I, I can't. That's too much work for me. This video is long enough and I'm trying to catch up, so... <coughs> See? I still got that going on. So, I'm going to try to heal up get this video out and running and I'll see you in part three which hopefully by then I should be better but I guess we'll find out together until then I'll be Grim and I'll be seeing you next time for more of this alien attack so will the Adams save Halloween I guess you're about to find out <laughs>